Okay. Okay. <coughs> so um, thank you, Bruno, to be uh, to be here. So uh, uh, Bruno is one of our colleagues uh, from Brazil who, who is uh, interested about uh, the activity of uh, French Society of Sports uh, Philosophy. So thank you to be present and uh, uh, I give you the the voice to transmit uh, us what you want to uh, share with uh, with us. Thank you, Bruno. Thank you, Gilles. Uh, good afternoon uh, to everyone. Uh, I would like to thank especially uh, Professor Gilles Lacorte for this invitation. Uh, it's an honor for me to speak in, in this week, Pierre de Coubertin International Committee. Uh, the Pierre de Coubertin French Committee have uh, the, the proposed title for today is uh, Another Football History, Football Esports and its Updates on the Esports Fan. Uh, I am a professor at Federal University of Campina Grande and Northeast in Brazil. Uh, I start with these images rocky arts of human hands uh, in the in island of Sulawesi, Indonesia, for uh, 44,000 years old, to, to walk in the anthropological importance of the use of your hands, the issue of the opposable finger for EU intellectual and technological uh, development make a parallel to the video games and the manual joysticks. Okay. Virtual sports are an important family with the general process of virtualization, making the interactions between what is current, real, and what is virtual goal beyond two barriers of time and space. Intensive uh, the sensations in a different sporting experience. These experiences are configured in a sports virtualization, in which esports are closed like to the body culture of movement. My study I to clasp the virtual games uh, of football in the game classification categories proposed by Kalua. This classification seeks to bring the points of approximation of the so-called virtual games to the traditional practice of food playing football, demonstrating a perspective that old laser practice are not being replaced, simple reconfiguring themselves into the new forms of experience provided by digital technology. The video games uh, have been forming contemporary sports culture, especially active video games, AVG, with target, uh, with other influences for information and communication technologies, promoting the formation of what has been called the cyber culture. Uh, cyber culture by Lemos is the sociocultural form that emerges from the symbiotic relationship a relationship between society, culture, and the new microelectronic based technologies. That emerges if the convergence of telecommunications with information technology. With the emergency of the new reality, that is not necessarily the replacement of old practice, but the reconfigura reconfiguration that's practice. Video games present themselves has a growing outlet with the scope of activities in the laser context. For example, previous young people get ready foot playing fields for a football play in Brazil, uh, they, they are naked player. Currently, they meet online to play a virtual game of FIFA soccer, Pro Evolution soccer, currently named eFootball and EA Sports FC the most popular football games, video games. In addition to so-called traditional video games, there are shows that involve the body movement, 
exergames and activity games. Breaking the old paradigms of design boredom and the barrier immobility in the practice. Promoting a radicalism in the spe spectacular structures of virtual sport and television telespectacles. The process of sport virtualization is an irreversible phenomenon and outtoped its subjects to misinterpretation. It can be beneficial and should be used didactically, as the ball rolling on the ground in the real life is not aligned. The boy with the joysticks also dreams on the ball that you kick with you to your feet. The tombs on young people's hands inspired the definition of the title of the book, Tamberlina, by Michel Serres, Serres, with analysis the digital revolution, revolution uh, that has been altering the pedagog pedagogical relationship, demonstrating that the construction of technology itself has transformed with the speed and the amount of information arising from internet access. As the chambers, what they may want to use it in the joystick of video games, uh, the importance uh, of the didactical appropriation by physical education professional is inferior. Thanks to recent sports virtualization out video games that involve the movement of players and virtual reality devices, there is a transformation of the entire body into a joystick for action in the video games. Make it possible to expand the vision of a body integrated in the cyberspace. Cyberspace. With can touch and feel, its movement causes consequences in virtual events. In this sense, sports and video games are not just a virtual simulation, but something of movement human motorist, poor and sample. What do not remove human being from the human condition, in fact, promotes a high stage of plus humanity, post humanity, if it does not abandon the body, but only enhances it. In the need to expression, some if very strong, very strong, or new in relation, in relation to pre existential social conventions, the men turn to games as a way to of expressing themselves without fear and is a free way. In other words, play appears to be a form of creation, expression, and the reconfiguration of social rules themselves. The games serve a way to release tension, to fulfill, fulfill intimate desires, or even to mi minimize the desire for desires that would be harmful to the social order. In playing, man seeks a bro broader meaning for his aspiration. He, he risks, challenges, plays, or he almost never does in real life. In a search for happiness, but the feeling of true freedom, science, in this environment, environment, uh, he can start over, you can make mistakes and still not be renewed, renewed forever. In the game, men can test, confront the rules of life in social. Figure, uh, figure out the position, the risk of instability. Two authors become fundamental to the understanding of games uh, as element of culture, yeah? namely Uzinga and Kalua. Okay, their first author is new work Homo uh, originally published in 1938. Yeah? Works with the idea that the games as original reality corresponds to one of the most primitive and deeply Roots notion in the raw reality human. From with culture is born in the form of ritual and sacred, uh, language and poetry. 
For Rizinga, the game remains in all types of arts of expression. And competition, including in the arts of thinking and speak, uh, in the judicial court, choked, prosecution and defense, as well as in a combat on the war in general, for example. The game and the, its notion, according to this Rizinga, are therefore all the then culture itself, are its part of the action of animals. It is from the game that culture is born. In the book, May Play and Games by Calois, it states that unlike using uh, who would have studied only the playful spirit. We press a study on games under the possible categorization. When evaluating the games, Calua included his, uh, in his analysis all types of games without underestimating uh, to the so-called games of change with in the view are the most human of all, since animal players, as with English states, but they not play games of change. But look, a characteristic that only belongs to humans, it is a statement. Kalwa proposes for classification categories for games. Agon, Alea, Maim, Inlix, which were permitted by the characters of idea and ludus. This classification uh, encompasses the entire understanding of the game yeah, uh, as a sociocultural element inherent to the human soul. So, that said, the aspects mentioned above corroborated the construction of a vision uh, about traditional play involving street games ball games, board games, among others. As will be seen later, throughout a reinterpretation in the light of video games. This line of jokes that the consideration of these tests are uh, guided by. That is, through uh, the, be the belief that real and virtual gaming mixed and in fact, can represent the same meaning, then it's a way conversion. Football video games uh, in the light of Kalwa. There are still demonstrates the role of video games in the formation of cyber culture, a new culture arising from the new information technologies and computerization which generates a society, a society increasingly interconnected by networks. In the sense, it's observed that football, as the most popular sport in the world, is consequently the sport that most undergoes this process of virtualization. Where the target media spectralization or virtual games, to better illustrate the first virtualization of video games in virtual games occurred in 1979 uh, years when the game Atari Soccer was launched in the United States by Atari, breaking all sales, breaking uh, all sales records and inauguration on the most successful franchise in the game market. That your football sports action, the best known and most played football video games today are chosen of the eFootball and EA Sports FC, considered the most played sports games in the bring talk to children, young people, and the adults around the uh, play, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series X, and PC. In chess games, we have national team and the main clubs in the world. We've played virtualized in a 
reliable way. The ways of competition can be against the matching, against the computer's artificial intelligence, with a human play on your side or across the ocean uh, <laughs> via the internet, one way by internet. Based on the categories listed by Calois, a significant grouping can be made in electronic games or video games. In football games, such as FIFA, EA Sports, social actors, players, when connected to the game, demonstrate that uh, they are, at the same time, argon, mimic, and mimic. In the dispute between the competence, able to use the joystick to accomplish what you want in the game of two peoples, we have the representative of Agon, Agon mimicry in the fiction created through the interpretation of virtualized stars in games and the transfiguration of themselves selves in the game, where recognizing themselves as the characteristics or including chain selves that took the play addition option. You can create a character like him with a name and the every narration present in the game, in which the play places itself as a social actors in the action, representing, for, for example, players like Neymar, Messi, or Cristiano Ronaldo. Helix is present among other aspects. When the play manages to score a goal, go into ecstasy, a layer is also present in the field comments, draws, and the truth who will get the fifth or second joystick, or every when deciding who will play in the fifth game in a championship between friends. As in all games, Pydea and Ludus are present. It is often highlighting that Pydea is closer to Elix when the play experience a strong emotional sensation upon achieving the ultimate goal, scoring the goal, a great moment of ecstasy in the real and virtual football. Ludus, in turn, is closer to the other categories, mainly Agon and Alia, Agon and Alia. As there is an order and the rules to be followed so that there is no corruption in the game, it should be noted that virtualization is not limited to useful spots, but the rate encompasses all structures of contemporary society. It is a dynamic, dynamic, dynamic process that takes up more and more spaces in people's lives, including the organization of cities, uh, relationships, network, and confluence of information without people often realizing this. Really, in sports, it is old nothing that they are playing in leagues and in tournaments similar to traditional sports. In this process of virtualization of video games, institutionalization and, and standardization of rules occur. With the organization of championships and federations, ranking, uh, sponsorship, and the remuneration of cyber athletes or pro players, né? the professional video games players, Consequently, leading to the professionalization of the practice and the players. A process similar to the transition for gambling to sport, which occurred notably in the 19th and the early 20th centuries in Europe. Among his sports, the, for example, the first personal shooters, uh, such as CSGO, and multiplayer online, Beetle Arena, MOBA. Uh, the most impor important multiplayer sport in the world is the MOBA uh, 
League of Legends, LOL. Uh, according to Pereira, a Brazilian actor, LOL has launched in 2009 by Riot Games. Currently, was approximately uh, uh, 70 million monthly players has been present since uh, 2011 in the main esports championships in, championships in the world. And promotes it, it our tournaments to such as the League of Legends Championship Series and the League of Legends World Championship. Among the main championships that made the history of esports, the following is told out the Electronic Esports World Cup and the World Cyber Games WCG. The Lady Banging being considered the most important global electronic games tournament or video games tournament organized by the company South Korean Technology, company Samsung, and the Korean Esports Association, CASPA, a public organization cre created with approval of the Ministry of Sports, Culture, and Tourism of South Korea. In the fifth edition took place in 2000, in the city of Seoul, its broke target cyber athletes for 78 countries. The fifth professional sport league, league as the Cyber Athlete Professional League, fund funded in 1997, by Anja Munoz, bringing targets around 300 cyber athletes in the fifth competition. Currently, the last edition of the Evolution Championship Series, 2016, uh, broke targets more than 10,000 cyber athletes or properties from the 73 countries in Las Vegas and United States of America. Regarding financial transactions, present that from 2014, indication a total price pool of uh, 23 million dollars in the esports championships of that year. And games like low exceed $1 billion dollars in annual sales. In, in relation to Brazil, Brazilian scenario, uh, we can highlight the final of the Law Brazilian Circuit, which took place at the Maracanãzinho uh, Gymnasium, Rio de Janeiro, in which approximately 6,000 people were present. And the emergence of idols, such as cyber pro players, for example, Felipe uh, BRTT Gonçalves, uh, on Law Player in Brazil. And Gabriel and Fallen Toledo, a player of CSGO, CSGO player. Despite, despite buying different football plays and games, there is a great media connection between them. For example, Brazilian football player Neymar Jr. It's a declarate fan of the CSGO, including his recent meeting with pro player Gabriel Toledo, had young media coverage. Some, some thing uh, that was categoric, categorically demonstrated on March uh, 23, in 2017, when the player Neymar celebrated his goal of the Brazilian football team with a tribute to the CSGO player. In the game, valued for the South American qualifiers for the World Cup in 2015, in which the Brazilian team beat the Uruguay team four by one at the Centenary Stadium in Montevideo. Neymar Jr. celebrated his goal in the match, in the match with a drawing moving and covering the eyes uh, with the arms in an uh, allusion of the flashbang, a light granite from the game CSGO, causing a lot of uh, causing uh, uh, a, a lot of comments from fans of the video games and social networks, uh, notably on the social networks Twitter, now X, né? including Sherry B, Gabriel, and Fallen Tolle. Uh, 
have a time. There are uh, comparative tables uh, between modern sports and cyber sports. But uh, I, I think that, uh, yeah, uh, talking about it, but for example, uh, factors, modern sports and sports video games. Uh, for example, factor game location, modern sports, gymnasiums, stadiums, tracks and courts, etc. Sports video games, little house, home, internet. Based on the relationship and similar exposed in the table, following the ideas of the aforementioned authors, you can infer the video games uh, can, can I show become content in all areas of education, including physical education, science of sports. Its inclusion is extremely important. Since as previously mentioned, it is a new way of sports manifest manifestation where we have cyber sports in a cyber generation that is being formed. And with these new spaces, cyber spaces, from with new and interim spreads and instruments emit. Final considerations. The virtualization of sports, it's an unhabitable phenomenon. And although it is subject to misinterpretation, it can be beneficial and showed by using the doctrine. As the ball rolling on the ground, its real life is not eliminated. In the world, in the other world, you understand that the game is a cultural education element. It's a quantity of physical education. Why then the importance of magnetism and the multiple possibilities that video games bring? They are closely linked to the children's culture and proved to be a representative element of the new culture that is open in a cyberspace. After all, it is through the experience of the virtual environment that the cyber, cyber generation gets to know a range of sporting games. Although they have never played any of them in the real field. Having said that, this is sports virtualization that is outlined in cyber culture presents itself uh, as an emerging, innovative field of reflection and the action for sciences part, sports sciences, uh, and consequently for the international Olympic movement. Was you read the battery today? Bibliography. Thank you for attention. Thank you, Mr. Gilles. My emails. Thank you, Bruno, for your uh, intervention. So, if someone has uh, some comments to to develop about uh, Bruno presentation, so Jim. Hi, Bruno. Uh, <clears throat> I want to ask a. Uh, uh, a question about a matter of fact. Often I hear it said that video games will bring people into sport. Is there any evidence for that? Or is that just a hope? So Hi. Yeah, yeah, Bruno, you can uh, take the floor. Yes, I, uh, I don't understand very well the, the finish of the uh, question, uh, questions, questions, questions. I don't understand. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, I didn't hear you very well. So I don't know what you said. Uh, she, she, I think I think uh, he did, did not hear 
uh, your okay, question. Okay. Yeah. okay, okay. Let me try again, Bruno. Uh, <clears throat> often I hear people say, what video games will bring people like, like video games of sport will bring people into sport uh, right yes. my question my question is do you have any evidence that that happens or is it just a hope yes uh, i make uh, histories in brazil for 15 years about the transition of uh, for example, scholar sports for the real life, the youngest uh, in this process of uh, video games, for example, football video games or tennis video games, uh, there are in sport not popular in Brazil, but uh, most students learning about tennis, court tennis, playing the video games. Uh, I have published uh, three articles. Uh, I can share uh, it to you of the whole colleagues, huh? but uh, I think that the esports, uh, the most important for me, uh, I think that the esports there are sports, but the effect is for the esports uh, don't have a uh, Olympic sports. There are uh, another discussion, but it's clear to me that esports there are esports. It's a process to the games uh, evolution for the sports. The sports evolution for esports. Esports evolution for all the games, all the sports, it's a cycle. Uh, I think that... <laughs> okay. Did, uh, can, I, can I come back? Is that okay? Uh, so I thought, I think you're saying that there is no evidence that children participate more in sport because they s use esports. In, in my students, I have uh, evidence in my students. My, in my stu studies, in, in my PhD thesis, I have evidence, but it, it's a uh, qualitative field of, of research. Okay, so the okay, so there's there's no quantitative evidence. Quantitative, that permission of generalization? No. Okay. Yeah. That's, I think that's important because people keep saying, oh, let them play video games and they will come to sport. Well, let's see it. Let's see how many do come to sport. And I see nobody. Tell you the truth. Sports, sports participation is going down and video gaming is going up. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Daniel, if you want... Oh, okay, good morning. And uh, thank you very much, Bruno, for your presentation. I would like to ask, uh, what are you thinking about the position of uh, of the referee in the virtual sports, in, 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 in the e-sports? There, there no no take part of the movement of the competition because there, every stances of the game are put in the flow of the program. But there's not the real Game. What do you think about it? Hello, Mr. Daniel, my colleague from Argentina, yes. <laughs> uh, the, there are a stop in the transmission of uh, you finish your walking. Uh, can you repeat, please? Sure. I think this connection the... is so bad. Yes. Uh, what do you think about the position of the referee during the competition? Not, not the, the physical position, but during the competition. It, it has a, 
a, a very poor activity because they may be in the international competition of esports, they only uh, looking for the pauses, you know, the, 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 the timekeeping and no more. Because the, 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 the same game declares who, who is the winner and who is the loser. Which is the, the reason for the future actions of referees in esports? Oh my God. <laughs> it's a great question. Uh, I think that uh, the esports actually, it has been. Uh, I think that the tomorrow esports or the future of esports. Uh, I think that Pratt is different. Uh, I think that's necessary. Uh, democratization of assets of instruments, consoles to the practice in the e sports. This is the first time. Uh, there are also uh, two the skill, the handle human skill to play the time of game. Uh, I don't know. I think this e-sports clear and future. Yeah. And that there are have inclusion in the Olympic movement, in the future. But now I think that uh, the, the active video games and e-sports adaptation of movement, corporal movement, yeah, for uh, experimental uh, championships around the world, uh, involving the Olympic International Committee uh, and the others. But uh, I can speak today that have similar the conception the structure of a game. Esports is a game. This game is similar to all games. Uh, for example, yeah, uh, speak this here. The cheese don't have a spot. For me, the cheese is a spot. The cheese online is a spot. Uh, but it's my position. It's my position. Uh, maybe I have a dream, <laughs> but uh, I think it, it, it's possible in future. It's, it's possible. I'm so.